Good evening. A family's worst nightmare became reality. Today, RCMP confirmed the identity of a body found beside Highway 19 near Comox yesterday morning. Keith Vath has our top story. The police tape and the emergency vehicles are gone, leaving a lonely stretch of road here on Highway 19 this morning. Yesterday, investigators closed the road as they combed the scene where a passing motorist spotted a body in the shallow ditch. The discovery shaking the family of Elizabeth Lagus. The 33-year-old woman from tiny Kinkham Inlet disappeared in Campbell River Tuesday, where she had come for medical appointments. Despite the grim find, her family kept up the search, hoping for the best. I just tried looking all over the place for her, all over town, and couldn't find her. Her teenage daughter sent me a text. traveling from Kinkham Inlet to help. Yeah, she's, she's really hurt right now, and she wants her mom home. But Friday night, police confirmed their worst fears. Well, there's certainly a lot of unanswered questions in relation to, to the death of Ms. Lagus. Uh, obviously, the location of where her body was found is, is, is suspicious on its own. Today, while Elizabeth Lagus's family and her community grieve, police are asking for help answering those questions. How and where she died, and whether or not it was murder. Uh, we don't have a determination on, on a cause of death yet. Uh, that will obviously be the big defining factor for us as to what sort of investigation we eventually have. Um, but in the interim, we're going to continue on with a suspicious death investigation and, uh, and work to answer all the questions that are outstanding. Investigators want to talk to anyone who saw Elizabeth Lagus in Campbell River or anything suspicious near where her body was found on Highway 19 between 10 Tuesday night and two Wednesday morning. They haven't shared exactly why that time is specific, specifically important, um, but it is important to them. So anyone in Campbell River who believes they may have seen uh, Elizabeth during those, those hours of 10, 10 p.m. and 2 a.m., uh, we're asking them to come forward and share their, their observations with us. With that information, police hope they can solve the riddle of Elizabeth Lagus's death and offer her family some peace.